Okay, so we have several people here today who want to tell you a little bit about Tanya and her accomplishments and all that she's done. So I'm going to start by introducing you to my friend Sean Mullally, who is a board member of this Muskegon Community College. I'll do the best I can with that. <laughs> All right, thank you, Mary. Um, every year, every election year, we hear people come around and they tell us this is going to be the most important election of our lifetime. And particularly in, in this district here, in, in the 91st district, you, you hear them say this, and this is the most important district in the whole state. And we hear that every time, and we get a little bit numb to it after a while, being, being told all that hyperbole every time, but it's true. This is a very important race, and this is, if not one of, you know, the most important districts in the whole state. It's a swing district, it's heavily contested every election cycle, and it really controls the balance and the direction of the whole state and where we're going to go for the next two years and making permanent changes going forward. And as a result of all that, it does always turn into a, uh, a really big political partisan battle and, um, you know, people sometimes get a little bit weary and, and a little bit tired of that. And I think it's important to have someone come in with, uh, with a level head with, uh, with real common sense, and that's who I think we've got in, uh, in Tanya. I've known Tanya for almost uh, 20 years now, and when I first met her, she was working for a, uh, an organization called the Lake Michigan Federation, doing a lot of environmental advocacy, talked me into uh, getting onto the board of that organization for, uh, for a term, and um, she's not someone who seeks out the spotlight. She's someone that does the in, the in the trenches work day to day, working towards results, working on issues, and delivering those results. You can, you step out the door here, you can see White Lake, and it is a lot cleaner now, in large part to, uh, to the work that she's done. And she is experienced in working on a, on a nonprofit organization, working in a consulting capacity, and you know, working for her for her herself basically. She's worked at the municipal level and local government, serving on the city council in Whitehall, and she's got a lot of experience working with state agencies and bureaucracies, and knowing how to get things done in that environment and produce results. So I believe she's got the temperament and the experience to do this job well, to represent this community well in Lansing, and to, to change the tone and produce positive outcomes. And most of all, she's got my trust. So that's why I'm supporting her. Thank you. 